Praise the name of Jesus. I want to welcome you to work for the Lord this Thursday night. And I want you to be ready for an encounter as we look at how you can generate testimonies. If you don't generate wonders, you cannot have testimonies. And one principal way of generating wonders and thereby generating a testimony is through worship. Miracle signs and wonders follow worshipers. Worshippers become wonders, and when you become wonders, you become testifiers. I'm not talking about singers, I'm talking about worshippers. Jesus said, if I be lifted up, I will draw all men to myself. He said, God is a spirit, and those who worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. In Exodus 15, 11, who is like unto thee, O God? Among the God who is like unto thee, the God that's glorious in holiness and fearful when he's praised. So praise, worship can be used to generate testimonies via wonders. David said in Psalm 34 verse 1, I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. The humble shall hear them and be glad. Magnify the Lord with me and let us exalt his name together. When you become a sweet psalmist like David, you become a king like him. Yes. Remember the two stories, one in the Old and one in the New Testament? When they began to sing and to praise in 2 Chronicles chapter 20, God sent ambition for the enemies of his people, and they were smitten. Hmm. The power of worship. The enemies were routed up. And when Peter... Well, as Silas were in prison, the sun praises and the prison door open. You become testifier when you become worshiper. Learn the heart of praise, the heart of worship, and you find that you become a wonder to your generation and amazement to your peers. I commend it to God and the word of his grace tonight. The mighty worshippers will rise out of this at a meeting tonight in the name of Jesus and testifiers with comfort. Through wonders of God in your life, you become testifiers of the goodness of God in the land of the living. So shall it be in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. That's how far we can go tonight. Don't miss any of our services on Sunday, 7 a.m., 9 a.m. and 11 a.m. And in the evening, we meet by 5.30. God bless you as you come and you will be blessed for it. Go forth and become testifiers in Jesus' name. Amen.